Hey YouTube, matches eight six zero. Smoking a Savinelli Roma three twenty. She's a beauty. Got a message a couple of weeks ago from Frederick in Belgium. He wanted to send me some semois, which is burly made in Belgium. Of course, I jumped all over that. Package arrived this week. Opened it up, and I was totally shocked. I had had my eyes on one of these for years, but I had always gone back and forth on whether it might have been too big a pipe for me. As it turns out, it's light as a feather, and even though the diameter, the diameter of the bowl is fairly large, it's still comfortable. I'm loving it. Thank you very much, Frederick. You went way overboard. the tobacco putting away for another rainy day because I just have way too much open right now but I'm looking forward to that I wanted to do kind of a follow-up to Drew of the Shed his last video called Choices Put a link in the bucket. And uh, he touched on customer relations and how they could ruin your day. Depending on what your attitude was. Attitude is so important. I got to thinking. I got into a management position right out of college. Anybody who's in management, you spend your day listening to and solving problems. Some days you might have five problems to deal with. Other days you might have 10, 12, more. I look back on my career now that I'm in my 60s. And I give it a lot of thought. Remembering I figured the most important thing was to get the problem solved, which is probably true. As I got to my 50s, I became a master at this problem solving business. But I still had those customers like Drew talks about. You just cringe when the phone rings and they're on the other end of it. I started thinking, you know, I love my job, but sometimes people can ruin it. 
because I started thinking more about it. I was looking at, you know, why do I have these people? They'll call me up, they got a problem for me to solve. I can say to them, you know, I'm really busy today, but first thing tomorrow morning I'll take care of you. And they're fine with that. You get somebody else, they barely say hello to you and they're practically up your butt. And what it turns out to be is that with some customers you miss the whole human element of dealing with them and the reason that you have such a rough time with them is because you never built up that relationship like you did with those other people who they'll wait a week for you hey no problem you know when you're ready just take care of my problem so it's starting to pour here I'm gonna wrap this up really quick. Whether you're dealing in management or sales or whatever, give some thought to the fact that uh, there's more than just solving the problem or providing the service or product. Remember the human element, build the relationship, you'll find your job becomes an awful lot easier. I'd love to sit here and finish this, but I'll be soaked in a minute. Thanks an awful lot for joining me. Hope you have a great day.